you've been looking at the prognostic value of BRAF V600 mutations, and this is in melanoma. Um, what were you looking at? What kind of melanoma and why were you looking at this? We were looking at the prognostic value in stage 3 melanoma patients. The stage 3 melanoma patient is the patient with lymph node involvement or intrinsic meds. And those, the, the, the prognosis of uh, s uh, such patient is very imprecise. It ranges from 20, 25% at 5 years to 87% at 5 years alive. Uh, so it has to be refined. And uh, the, the second uh, way to, to second way, thing that was important for us to, to, to do the, the job is that we now have drugs that are active on BRF mutated melanoma, and it is uh, there are there are tri trials that have been done, and we are waiting for the results on as a, a, on a, a dual inhibition as an adjuvant therapy, but we we were not able to know what is the exact prognosis of this patient at the uh, uh, stage 3 according to their BRF status or not. So we did a validation study because we did a small uh, retrospective uh, study uh, which was published in the archives of surgical oncology uh, in 2012 which uh, uh, showed that BRF, the presence of BRF mutation was associated with a worse prognosis and with a, a hazard ratio of 2 for a, a decent metastasis for survival and overall survival. And we used a cohort, a prospective cohort of patients, a Milan cohort, which uh, recorded a lot of patients, and we uh, looked at all stage four, uh, three patients, and we uh, took their, their tumors and their, metast their metastasis their, in the lymph node and looked and uh, assessed their BRF status, and then looked at their outcomes. And at the end, we made a multivariate analysis, and what comes uh, is first the HECC staging, the age, and the PRI status. And these three factors are the, f the three main prognostic factors involved in uh, stage 3 melanoma. Right, so BRAF status mu mutated, B yeah. BRAF V600, is, is negative, it gives you a higher risk, but on the other yeah, hand... It, it, if it is mutated, it, it gives you a higher risk, of, with a hazard ratio of nearly two. And you can target it though, so how, how does that change the, the, the clinical picture for doctors now, uh, and now and in the future looking ahead? Yes. You can... Uh, today I think not, it would not change, but within one year, one year and a half, we are going to have the results of the trials that have tested the BRF inhibitors plus MEK inhibitors in that situation. I think they, they will be positive. So we have to give the advice to the patient, should I take this drug or not? Because it's one year treatment, it's a costly treatment. So it's very important to give uh, to the patient their, their prognosis in terms of a chance, a chance of relapse and chance of death, of death at five years in order to, to, to the patient to make their choice. Because when you are at adjuvant treatment, it's different. All the patients are not going to die and some patients don't want to be buried with the disease, others are very anxious and they want everything to be... So it's, it's important to have the exact uh, prognosis. And it is... Um, when I gave you the figures of the stage 3, and it is so huge um, uh, um, variation between... So we have to, to, be very more, to, to be more precise. And if you have a stage 3C, BRF mutated melanoma and you are more than 50 years of age, the prognosis is very, very bad. So you should take the treatment. Right, so you, you're getting some uh, information to help you uh, um, individualize therapy. Yes. What is the overall clinical picture then emerging from this, if you could summarize that for cancer doctors? For cancer doctors, I think, I think the cancer doctors should have their patient tested for melanoma, for BRF testing, at for stage four, of course, because it uh, leads to the uh, uh, target therapies, but also at stage three, because you get you have better insight into the prognosis, and you have also the 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 the, the results ready in case they become stage four.